Yo, it's still YouTube. It's your boy First Class 305 coming at y'all with a quick uh, video. It's like 5.09 in the morning to be exact. Just got in the doors. Um, and I just got, I checked my emails for some reason. I just felt the need to have to check my emails. And I did get the messages from a couple of you cats about the playoff 12s. I just got to sort through the emails and see who hit me up first. So, you know, he they get first dibs on them and whatnot, you know what I'm saying? Just so everything is clear and I'm not out here bullshitting nobody or nobody gets the shaft and just making sure it's fair. Um, definitely got all the emails, definitely got all the text messages. I appreciate it. I'm gonna get back to y'all within the next, before, before Monday, uh, Tuesday latest. I'll let y'all know exactly which way I'm gonna swing with that. Um, <clears throat> but the main reason for making this video, man, is just cause somebody else, bro, if you haven't seen it yet, go back to that video, the last update video with uh, the playoff 12s. And go down to the comment box. I'm not going to delete the comments because personally, it really don't, it don't bother me at all. Uh, but I felt like since he took so much effort and so much energy to go ahead and leave these comments that make absolutely no sense and just make them look just beyond retarded, uh, I'm going to let the sneaker fam know about it too. You get what I'm saying? I figured I'll just I'll, I'll, I'll put a little bit of energy, not as much as he did because dude left like five comments, sent me a personal message and all this garbage. You know, because he's over here, he's mad or something. I don't know whether he's a dude who just ain't getting no money or um, he's a dude that ain't getting no women or he's just really bored, man, on his mom's laptop. So, you know, either way, I'm definitely going to go ahead and uh, address that issue because that's, y'all yeah, know, y'all already know that's how I do. And um, this basically, yeah, y'all already see that, man. I'm soaking wet. It's pouring outside uh, out here in South Florida or whatever. So, yeah, anyways, uh, this message goes out um, to the slut bucket. <laughs> aka vagina monologue ass mouth nigga uh his name is boomer boomer ho ho damn i mean coco uh is boomer coco i guess his name is on here and he's he's real tight he's real upset he's real upset he's he's referring to me first class 305 and y'all dudes know me anybody who's been rocking with me since day one already know me and dude is, has the audacity to call me a really a reseller because i gotta pay a t playoff 12s for 210 dollars I don't understand how that works, but I mean, you know, people get tight, people and nobody, you're not going to make everybody happy, so I definitely know the family's going to tell me that about, you know, you can't make everybody happy, niggas always going to have haters and all that other garbage, but I just felt the need to have to address it, because at the end of the day, nothing against resellers, because you know what I'm saying, niggas going to do what they got to do to get money, but little homie fails to understand this is not my primary source of income, it's not even my secondary source of income, it's not even a miscellaneous source of income, I don't do this for income because I get real money, you know what I'm saying, um, profit margin is entirely too low in sneakers for me to even get in that game, man, I don't understand, I got, I got too many expenditures for me to be worrying about making $20 off a pair of sneakers, the main reason for me buying the playoff 12s was A, to try out Nike.com to see if I was able to go ahead and do it that way, which I did, hence why I'm selling them now, and also because I wanted to look out for somebody who wasn't going to be able to get them in their local city. You know what I'm saying? I know how cats are out there and the resellers are running rampant. So they scooping up 10, 12 pairs of shoes. I already told you how the manager's doing out here. So, you know what I'm saying? I definitely want to look out for somebody and scoop those up. But at the end of the day, I got to pay shipping. So, 210. So let's think about that logically. Retail form, after taxes and everything is 170, homie. I understand how that's A, the raping that you like to call it or a reseller at that i don't understand how that works but you know what i'm saying it's no pressure i'm not taking too much i'm not gonna take up too much of your time with this shit it's just i just really felt like i had to address them and i'm the type of nigga i don't like to you know beat around the bushes or, you know balk sideways and nothing like that this goes out to, to to the vagina monologue nigga uh boomer coco um boomer coco one i think it is because he wanted to be the first boomer coco because people actually kept that name um for me, it's more like dumber ho ho, but whatever. I'm, I'm not even gonna feed too much into it. I'm not gonna go ahead and uh, get involved in too much childish name calling and nonsense. Just really wanted to pull a card right quick, let this dude know that, come on, man, first class 305. I do this for real. I'm out here just trying to talk sneakers. I'm trying to out there and meet new people. I'm trying to kick it out here and just bullshit, man. So, for all that nonsense, pump your brakes on me. I guarantee it's one of the dudes who couldn't get a pair of Concords and now he's just tight. Because everybody, you know, for everybody who this, this is in the third, I'm not a reseller. Never tried to be a reseller. I got the shoes for X amount of dollars. I'm selling them for X amount of dollars. If you like it, fine. If you don't, that's fine. And just to be clear, just to add a little tidbit of information. Or any people out here who already, you know, that know I'm from South Florida or whatnot, excuse me, 
um, should already be conscious of the fact that I put them up on Craigslist. I put them up for one dollar offers, a semi year offers. I'm not even trying to make any money. I, I would tell me what the shoe is worth to you, and that's what you'll pay. And I've had multiple offers of over of two fifty and over. We've, we're going to talk about ranging from two fifty to two seventy five. We have a couple of dumbasses offering me retail, which that's not even possible. But you're talking about offers two fifty plus. And I'm turning them down because I want to just let the YouTube fam know about it and, you know, give somebody on YouTube the chance to scoop them up that's subscribed to my page and that's doing it to death on, on you know, it's part of the sneaker feeling squizzy. So it's just basically it, man. I just find it. I found it amazing. I, like I said, I just checked my email at this time of morning because I just walked in through the door um, from getting real money, um, legal money. But. It just found it amazing to me that somebody was actually going to just classify me based on the fact that I'm sure he hasn't even watched any of my videos to know what I'm really about. But crabs going crab and hoes going ho. So, you know what I'm saying? I can't expect too much from these puss ass niggas. Um, excuse my language. I know I'm throwing a lot of curse words out here in this video. This is not going to be a constant basis. It's just a moment right now. I just want to make sure I go ahead and kick it to the nigga and let him know what it is. Uh, barking up the wrong tree. I'm not gonna here threaten nobody, neither. It's, it's childish. It's YouTube. You're not. You ain't about nothing. I know you ain't about nothing. You just felt like getting off your chest because you feel like a gorilla today. I don't know if you just finished watching a 50 Cent video. I don't know if you just finished watching a Rick Ross or listening to some Tupac on your mom's laptop. But you know, Boomer Coco one. Just get it together, homie. Like you need to. You really need to know what you're talking about and really, really know what a person's about before you start giving them labels and 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 calling death upon me. Like, come on, man. Real talk. <sighs> Let's be serious. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna outlive you, homie. You know what I'm saying? You keep crabbing and barking like that to a nigga in the street. You ain't gonna live too long. But you know, you can't give these faggot ass kids too much advice because then they get tight and they just want to. They, they, they want to become gorillas, man. And you can't be a gorilla when you a chimp. So, either way, man, it's your boy First Class 305. I'm out your ears, I'm out your face. Chuck up the deuces. Salute. Oh, also, one thing, I'm definitely going to go ahead and, uh, I'm still waiting on my charger, man, so I can upload another official, 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 real official video, uh, with the whole playoff 1204 compared to the 2012 joints. Uh, apologize for that. Honestly, it's not my fault. Waiting on the, uh, on the charger, whatnot. So, as soon as that charger comes in, definitely going to blaze that up, show y'all what it is. And give you like a real in-depth comparison and review on those. And also, we're going to get back to talking some sneaker shit, man. I've been, I mean, I strayed away from it for a little bit because I've been real busy and shit. So I've just been, you know, talking what's coming to mind. But I really got some content that I really want to discuss and talk about and whatnot. So y'all definitely stay tuned for that. And uh, if you ain't part of the Sneaker Fiend Squad, I think this video is going to tell y'all, you know, it's going to show y'all what we really be about. <laughs> but anyways, man, it's First Class 305. Like I said before, I'm out your ears, I'm out your face. Chuck up the doses. Salute. And yeah, my nail's still long, nigga. Fall back.